Hey guys, uh, John David Cole here with the Country Squire in Jackson, Mississippi. And, um, you know, it's funny, I woke up this morning and was really excited. It's December now. And um, I, it's, it's time that I go through one of my, uh, my uh, most looked forward to pipe rituals of the year. And that is uh, opening my next tin of Christmas cheer. And, uh, and, and I got to think about it. I was like, man, I ought to share this with, uh, with people uh, from across the world. So um, anyway, I just thought I'd talk about it a little bit and kind of kind of share with you, uh, you know, some thoughts that I have on this time-honored tradition. Um, you know, as pipe smokers, we tend to be kind of romantics. We look for a lot of meaning and, uh, you know, um, have a lot of fun with the, um, you know, the, gr the greater, uh, greater story that we're a part of as far as the, you know, historical aspect of, of our hobby. So, um, you know, there's always something fun to, like this to look forward to. And, um, and, and I always love opening my next tin of Christmas cheer. It's, uh, it just makes you feel like you're a part of something greater. So um, Christmas cheer is a blend uh, made by McClellan. Uh, it's in these beautiful uh, red tins you can kind of see. Mary McNeil actually does all this artwork herself. She's the president of the company. And um, I always tell people it's amazing when you order from McClellan, um, you, you literally talk to the president when you pick up the phone. You know, I mean, that's, that's who answers the phone. They're just really good people. They get the best leaf in America. And, um, we've sold their stuff for a long time and, and really believe in it. But um, this is my 2016 tin of Christmas cheer. And uh, what, what McClellan does here is they pick uh, Virginia tobaccos that are super small batch. They go around uh, dealing with these tobacco dealers and they, they are in with the best. And so they're constantly looking for, um, you know, the best, uh, sweetest, uh, most, most prime leaf. And, um, and so they, they age it for a while. They put it, put it back and then they make the tin and of tobacco. And then, um, and so each, but each blend every year is going to be a little different because it's such a small batch of tobacco. So, um, it's December, uh, which means it's time for me to buy my 2016 tin of Christmas cheer. But what that also means is that it's time to open my 2015 Christmas cheer. Um, and I like to do this, uh, you know, every year. What I do is I put the previous years back, and then I, um, you know, will will start to, um, you know, just let it sit. And then as I put the as I put that uh, the new tin back, then I'll you know open the previous years each year. And so it's just kind of a fun tradition that that we do. But um, what happens in that year time in the in the Christmas cheer is pretty magic. This um, aerobic. Uh, fermentation process uh, starts to happen once these uh, uh, little microbes that live in this tin uh, eat up all the oxygen the, there's something magical that starts to happen to the sugars and it, it really uh, really creates a special special uh, thing there's just something that happens to those sugars during that extra fermentation process that um, makes the makes the tobacco just uh, really something special. So, um, so I like to give it about a year before I smoke Christmas cheer, and I think that adds a lot to it. I think you'll, if you ever try to do it yourself, you'll, you'll notice the same. So, um, here we go. I'm gonna open my 2015 Christmas cheer. Uh, it's always beautiful. It's got the same artwork every year, but each year uh, you'll notice it's got kind of a different color. This is kind of a nice blue green Santa Claus here. It looks like the 2016 has. Uh, kind of a kind of a black Santa Claus so they just kind of switch it up you know that way you know um, you know you know it's, you know it's different so uh, and I'll read this to you let's see uh, we are proud to offer our 2015 Christmas cheer pipe tobacco an exceptionally fine vintage tobacco hand blended and aged pressed into cakes to develop natural mellowness uh, this 2015 blend is made with special selection of rich ripe flu cured Virginia from an outstanding 2011 Old Belt crop. Superb leaf, hand-picked uh, at peak ripeness, is natural in sweet, rich oils. Uh, it should age with distinction. So, and uh, that, they go on just to talk about kind of, you know, uh, their philosophy in buying some small batch leaves and, and that type of thing. So, um, here we go. It's time for Christmas cheer. <laughs> if I can get it open. <laughs> it's always a really lovely tobacco of course it smells fantastic um, Christmas cheer they always uh, make into kind of a broken flake you can see it here McClellan doesn't make uh, flakes like uh, you might see Dunhill or Orlick make you know they they tend to make them a little more thick cut and uh, and then uh, you know put them in a, a 
kind of a, a broken flake uh, and, and then put them in a tin like this, uh, which some people don't prefer. Um, you know, it, it, I kind of go back and forth, but, uh, but it definitely is a style of cut that I think has its own place. So it's really, real pretty tobacco. Has that kind of, uh, um, you know, uh, trademark McClellan smell to it, which I think is, uh, is always a lot of fun when I open a new McClellan tin. But, um, anyway, there's 2015 Christmas cheer. Look forward to lighting that up, um, here momentarily. And, uh, if you have a tin of Christmas cheer, you ought to, you ought to crack it open. It's time of year to do to do that and uh, give us your thoughts and uh, let us know what you think. So again, John David Cole here with the Country Squire in Jackson, Mississippi. Uh, tobacconist, been here since uh, 1970. And uh, you can learn more about us and our shop at uh, thecountrysquireonline.com. So thanks and to all of you have a very Merry Christmas.